Hi, I'm Jake White. A couple of years ago, I was lucky enough to coach the Springboks and we went on to win the World Cup. Today, I'm currently Director of Rugby at the Vodacom Bulls. So for me, my focus has changed. I want you guys that are youngsters to grow up to be the best rugby players you can. And today, Coach Joey is going to teach you about running forwards, but passing backwards. Thanks, Jake. To help me with today's lesson, we've got two Vodacom Bulls players here. As I mentioned last time, you can score points by either carrying the ball and scoring a try, or you can kick the ball over the crossbar. Speaking about kicking, this is how we start a match in Beliki Rugby. The kickoff. So, if you catch the ball from kickoff, you may run with it, usually closer towards the try line, or you may pass it to your teammate, but only if he or she is behind you. In rugby, you're never allowed to pass the ball forwards. So, if someone passes the ball forward, or if you drop the ball while trying to catch it and it rolls forward, the referee will allow advantage to the other team until the next mistake is made. If they haven't turned over possession yet, the referee will stop the game and award a scrum or a tap and go to the opponents. So what did we learn today? If you catch the ball from the kickoff, you can run forwards with the ball, but you must always pass the ball backwards. If the ball moves forward from your hands, by accident or not, a scrum could be awarded to the opposition. Does this scrum sound strange to you? Have you ever seen one before? Don't you worry about that. We'll tell you more about scrums on a future episode here on Jake's Kickstart.